Whoa. And here we are traipsing along a path. It's amazing how much wooded area is in Bolton, which is one of Britain's large towns. Probably, in fact, the largest town in Britain. And quite an urban area. And then yet there's all this woodland around it. Oh, it's somebody's coffee percolating. How weird. It's amazing what people will just throw away around here. Do you think, who goes out for a walk in the countryside taking a coffee percolator with them and decides halfway through, actually I didn't want this. These trees and plants always remind me of banana plantations. These are palm trees, but somebody's just whisked them over the fence. Yeah, again, fly tipping. And now, if you look closely, we can see a bit more of Bolton of the new build areas and some sort of cathedral or church, I'm not sure which, over in the background. Church, sorry. Is it a church? Yeah, there's no cathedral within about 40 miles. Oh yeah, I'm getting confused because Manchester's got a cathedral, hasn't it? Yes. Bolton has many churches and there's one mill chimney. If you look over there, mm -hmm. uh, Bolton used to have several hundred of them uh, back in the Industrial Revolution and uh, that's one of very few that's left. Wow. Over there, it's dammed, just behind that white block. Oh, that's actually an overflow. The idea is if the river floods, mm -hmm. instead of flooding all this area, it can then come through this channel, and this is like a, a um, an overflow channel. Right, so I'm actually confusing the, the position of the river, am I? Yeah, the river goes right. around okay. over there, but there's been a lot of problems. This is very low-lying land, and it, it has is, flooded yes. in the past. This river channel here was dug when they built these houses. All right. But it seems rather than leaving this as a river, they've just made it so there's um, an overflow there. So if the river, the, the water level in the main river gets too high, it'll some of the water will then start running through here. Fair enough. Oh, and yeah. that because it's a good idea then. Actually, there's another reason they might have done that as well. Mm -hmm. Insurance. Um, if your house is within a certain distance of um, a flowing water course, it affects your insurance premiums. Of course. And this wouldn't be classed as a permanently running water course. Ah, here's the river. Yep. This is the River Tong, isn't it? Um, I'm not sure. Well, we are on Tong Boor. Mind you, I haven't said. Mind you, haven't said that in Durham. We lived on Gilesgate Moor, and there was no Gilesgate River. So <laughs> there we are. Nice flowing water with a little waterfall over there. That's very nice. And then a concrete yeah. bridge. Very picturesque. Actually, have you noticed, Jen, how low the water is here? I suppose not. The things you find in a river are quite strange, aren't they? I've got some sort of mirror block, block brick metal thing there. Bits more metal. And then an old world hand cart. Oh look, cricket world. Oh, stop the presses. A world made of cricket. Mm. Is that the spot or the insect? I wouldn't like to go and throw deeply. Well that's the thing, if it's a spot then it's going to be a boring planet. And if it's the insect it's going it's to be a noisy planet. The home of the leisure suit, see? Leisure world. Oh, right. This is probably the sport then, isn't it? We used to come here for children's parties when I was young. Yeah, it was a fashion back then, wasn't it? Not a lot of people around today. We're still early. Supposed to say hi. Hi. Sorry, you have to speak up. I said, I'm sure they make the buses around here as loud as possible. You didn't get the joke. Very, very sunny day, isn't it? I'm hoping it stays this well for the rest of the summer. Do you think it will, Jim? I don't know. You can never tell with this country. That's true, yes. They all say that there's a, a long, hot summer normally follows a very cold winter. Well, we, we have had, had an incredible cold. What was it, minus 16? Uh, we got temperatures down to minus 16, which I, I've never known temperatures that cold in this this part of the country my entire lifetime. Fair enough. And then all of a sudden this, it's like wow. There'll be a hose back then. I know. That's a stupid thing. 
other hand, it doesn't really bother us, does it? Well, no, because we don't use it in a horse pipe. I was about to say, we don't use a dust pan, but I don't think we're actually talking about dust pans. Hello, Jennykins. Hello. Okay, do you want to say goodbye to the people watching? Goodbye to the people watching. Well, that's it for me today. I can't really stay outside anymore. I've got to do some work. And uh, besides, if I stayed out much longer, I'd probably find that my immune system would try and kill me off because autoimmune diseases suck. So I'm going to have to say bye-bye for now and I'll see you next time.